Hi all, Lunch from Express Unity, and today I just wanted to kind of do a little bit of a smallish devlog. I don't do too many of these, but I do want to start kind of logging the development of this project. Um, now this is something that I did start quite a while ago, maybe like a, a four or five months ago. Um, maybe even longer than that, but yeah, kind of got busy and then COVID hit and I kind of just pushed the project well out of the way. Um, but yeah, I really want to get started um, doing some devlogs with this. Um, I'm not going to be stopping the uh, Fall Guys clone videos. Uh, I will still be keeping those coming at the same rate they've been coming, probably one video a week. Um, but on top of that, I'll probably be also be doing uh, one video a week for this devlog as well. So, I haven't really got a, a solid name for it. I've kind of just been calling it uh, Drift Highway for now. Um, but basically, the system is a procedural road generator um, that I've made that basically is able to generate all types of roads. At the moment, there's only a select few prefabs, um, but it is also able to generate small city chunks alongside the road. Um, and I kind of just want this to be a, a retro feeling game where there'll be kind of these random things that will happen as you're drifting drifting along the highway. Um, so, I don't know, you'll, you'll be drifting and then maybe some weird, wacky alien shit will come and try and shoot at you and you kind of try and dodge it. And the the more you drift, the more points you get. That's kind of the, the gist of it. But then if you crash or you get hit or you fall off the road, then that's game over. So it's kind of a basic, basic idea. Um, so currently what I have is this procedural generating road. Um, it does check three roadblocks ahead before it spawns roadblocks and does about four or five checks before it makes a decision on what is the best uh, path to spawn new roadblocks because you don't want it to be kind of looping around and spawning road on itself. Um, and then on top of that, I have a kind of a destructible sort of mesh for the car. So if you do crash, it will actually show that you've been to the car. Um, and then I've just currently got a few post-processing effects going on. Um, so this is kind of to where I've gotten with the project. I think it took me about a month or two to get it to this stage. Um, but now that I'm back working on it, I'm hope hoping to get at least one video a week um, for the devlog with this. Um, again, I'm new to devlogs. I don't do them too, amount, too often, so I'm probably going to be pretty bad at it. But I hope you guys enjoy this. Um, again, the Fall Guys clone tutorials are still coming. Um, but yeah, I kind of just want to do devlogs alongside them because I just kind of want to change up my content and I want to have a bit of fun with it. Uh, so yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this little quick preview of what I got. And... Um, I'll see you guys in the next video.